Today you're going to learn how to find law, and that is the first step in identifying the name of a minor key signature. When your key signature contains sharps, this is what you're going to do. The rule for sharp key signatures is that the last sharp is T. The last sharp is the one farthest to the right, farthest away from the clef sign. We're trying to find law and to get from T, our last sharp, to law, we need to go down one. There's T. Below that is law. So here's a key signature example. Our last sharp is the one farthest to the right away from the clef sign, and that is this one here on the top space. That is where T is located, the note that would be drawn right here in the space. We're going to go down one more to law. So on this line, T, law. Second example, there's only one sharp, so that is the last one on the line. So T is on the line. Law is one step below on the space. Final example, on this one, your last sharp sits right above the line. T is here and law is one step down. All right, let's do flats. The last flat is fa. Last flat in a key signature is always fa. The last one is the one farthest to the right. We are still trying to find law, but now we're starting from fa instead of starting from t. To get from fa, our last flat, to law, we have to go up two. So our first examples here, last flat is this one on the line. That's where fa is. We're gonna go up two from there. Fa, so, la. Last flat is this one on the space. Fa is there, go up two. Fa, so, la. And our last flat here is fa. Fa, so, la. And that is it.